Hello, today we are uh, come to Exeter in uh, wherever we are, wherever that is, uh, Dorset or Somerset or some other county. Anyway, Exeter. Uh, and we're here for this uh, show. This is the motability show uh, for people who have uh, a, a motability vehicle or want a motability vehicle or they want a um, scooter or some other device uh, part of the allowance that you get so DLA or if you get uh, PIP which I do now um, the idea is that you can <coughs> pass it over to your uh, car provider and you actually I'm trying to cover the microphone because it's a bit windy um, have I gone down the wrong I think I've gone down the wrong side. <laughs> oh dear. Never mind. Oh no, no, I'm all right. I'm okay. Uh, but the show is actually mainly for cars. So there's lots of cars on display. So you can go and sit in them, try them out. Uh, you can't actually drive any of them. But there's a couple that you can drive. Um, but nothing that I would want to drive. They do scooter hire, so if you haven't got your own scooter, you can come here and uh, borrow one. But I think you've got to probably book it. Uh, there's a car park shuffle, a shuttle, even. Um, so let's go inside now and see what we can see. Just uh, experience. Hello. Thank you. Talking for a drink. Oh, okay. Thank you. <laughs> yes, put a bag in it. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be good. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Cheers. So here we go. This is the whole uh, exhibition area. I came here three years ago uh, when I first had my my latest vehicle. So you can see that there's loads of cars. They do all sorts of hand controls and uh, various other devices. So what we'll do is we'll have a little scoot round uh, and see what we can see. But they do WAVs. This is a WAV. It's a wheelchair accessible vehicle. Uh, so you can sit in the car with your wheelchair and there's hand control things over there hand control here so you can steer your car uh, here with the various adaptions and um, oh and the hoist and uh, oh they all seem to have these uh, adaptions so I say it's mostly vehicles, mostly cars in here and outside because this is what it's all about. It's about um, motability cars. Cornwall Mobility, they've come up from Cornwall. And there's various stands and things. Looks like they've got a scooter one there. Bring a scooter. Gow rings are quite a famous uh, adaption. For, they, they adapt vehicles for um, wheelchair access. There is uh, different vans and things, very large vans. Advanced payments. Uh, when you have a vehicle, you have to pay some money up front. So this is like 3,400 uh, for the van. And um, all different types. And then if we go out and pop outside, we'll have a quick look outside. Then all the other vehicles, the normal vehicles as they were, the different um, different makes that you have so currently got a Ford uh, which is 
my Ford S Max. I don't know where Ford is at the moment in here. Of course, I've got to choose a new vehicle um, when my vehicle comes up for renewal. Uh, so I don't know when that, um, exactly that is, but it's the end of this year uh, when you when it will be. Uh, that's quite a nice one. That's an A-class uh, Merc. I have a fancy driving a Merc. I don't know. Ah, here's the here's the Ford. They were here last year, over here in this corner. They didn't have the S, uh, S Max. Oh, they, they had the S Max, but they didn't have any for me to drive or sit in. Now they're trying to flog this one. This is the Cougar, I think it is. Is this a Cougar? Four nine five. They're saying advance payment. large boot. I don't know, I think it's a Cougar. I think it's Ford Cougar, I think, because uh, we're in the Ford. They're trying to flog the, the, the Cougar, because they, they've obviously got a lot of eco sport. Uh, nil payment. So basically that means that there's no deposit. So you can have the car as is for your allowance. It's got a, um, it's got a little funny looking door, not like a normal door. It's quite a small car actually, to be honest. So the other Ford, no S Maxes on show. No S Maxes, why not? Not good enough. And now we're on to Skoda's. So the, uh, the only one that I would look at would be a, uh, oh that's a Samsung that one, it's quite nice. That's quite pleasant, quite nice looking. Don't know how big the uh, boot is. Look around the back, oh, it's fairly small. Oh yeah, you wouldn't get the scooter in that. You wouldn't get the scooter in that one. So there's the Octavia and Fa Fabia. There's no Yeti. Where's the Yeti? They haven't got half of these cars. They haven't got half of them. So what's this one? This is, oh, this is the Merc, Merc area. Here. Oh, Nissan, this is. Uh, no, I don't like Nissan. Uh, oh, that one's got a hoist in it, that's interesting. That's got a hoist. Yeah, I wonder where the. Cougar's nice, but the boot isn't that big. I mean, that, that will be my, my choice, would be another Ford. Um, let me see if I can get a quick shot. Boot some. Um, yeah, it's not that big, actually. So, what other ones have we got here? That is really big. Bet we can't get around the back though. See, that's Sanyong. Ding dong. Ding dong, you're not wrong. That's what they say. Let's see if we can go around here. Oh, that's flipping huge. That's a huge boot. Seven seater, is it? Yeah. But it's the other way around. Most of them, the three, yeah. is in the back and then two. Two in the middle. Yeah. That's a bit weird, isn't it? Yeah. Well, I suppose it's like a four. It's a four-seater, and then you can 
I don't know whether you can take that out or not. That'd be good if you yeah, I think the man said take all that out. Yeah. yeah. A massive bit would be massive, wouldn't it? Yeah. 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 Trouble is the bigger the boot, the more rubbish it goes. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> yeah. It looks alright, actually. My Zertis Max, so I'm used to the the Oh Christ, it is it is higher. It's a lot higher. <laughs> Limey. Yeah, it's huge. It's flipping huge. That is a bit strange. Hello. Hi. Where are we off to then? Well, where would you like to go? <laughs> Chauffeur driven. It's a long way up. You need a step ladder, don't you? Well, is there a thing there? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, there is. I'm just diving. Yeah. There's a handle, but not on my side. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. Cheers. What do you think? Comfy, isn't it? Comfy. Yeah, But it's so huge. I love it. No, I don't like the dip here. And then Citroen, I don't like Citroens. Oh, let's have a look at the Jeep. This one's a Jeep. It's a bit small. Don't think we get, no, we won't get the scooter in that one. Fiat. Uh, BMW. Oh. Do I want to be a BMW driver? No, I don't. Golf, polo, could be a golf driver, an Audi, I could be an, I could be an Audi driver, oh. that'd be alright because then I could drive in an Audi, I could park in disabled bays and I would be allowed to. So Volvo and Mitsubishi. And this is the test truck. Test drive. Free prize draw. And them cars too, uh, Rush. Booked your test drive now. Have they got any? I ask. Is that it? No, that's not it. You, you're from Quickfit itself, are you? Yes. Why is there always a problem? Because there's like, online booking and you can't. It doesn't work. Oh. I always have a problem with it. Well, it might be because of your vehicle. Some vehicles we can't take an online booking because. We might need to know what brand of tyre is on the vehicle. So um, I track the online booking numbers and we're doing about 300 a month. So I know it does work. Mm. There may be a reason why. What vehicle have you got? S Max. I don't think there'd be a technical it's reason. It's really annoying because one time I've used it maybe three times in total right. in all the years that oh. I've had a car. Well, I tell you what, we've changed. I haven't used it for about a year. Oh, right, there's a new process, there's right. a new system. Well. But it's with the old system, I made a booking, which I thought was a booking. I went down there and uh, and they said, no, we ain't got no booking for you. Have you got a minute? We can do one for yeah. you now. Well, I don't need one at the moment. I'll but just show you the process yeah. we can oh, do. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. easy to do, yeah. I think. Yeah. Famous last words, hang on, we'll <laughs> see what happens now. This will but, all go you know, around. it was really frustrating because the way that you go down there, you have to go down there, they're always busy, they can never fit you in. Yep. And you always end up waiting three hours. I mean, one tyre, I had to, I took three hours to do one tyre. And the point is that, you know, if I want to go off somewhere, um, I have to unload my scooter, go It's off downtown, yeah. come back. To be honest, we, you know. um, I mean, we understand how difficult that can be. Yeah. Also, from our point of view, 
it's, do you know, it's in all honesty, it's almost impossible to hold every tyre we could possibly need because mm. every new vehicle has oh, a new tyre. Oh, yeah, tire yeah, tire. I appreciate so that. So we, we've always been, culturally, we've always been a, a wild new weight service, but we're having to change anyway because yeah. we, we need, the only way we can guarantee we've got a tyre is if we know you're coming in. in yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, let's search that. So now it should tell me what your vehicle is, if it works. <laughs> I should never, I, it's a real risk trying this in front of you. No, it'll go wrong. The it will always quite, go wrong. Yeah. Well, the connection's a bit slow here, yeah. so we're waiting for the. I've connected yeah. to the Wi-Fi here, but it's not very good. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> right, so it says... OK, so it says, Tire booking is available for your vehicle. To order tyres, please click the button below. So let's go there. So obviously... I would need to know what tyres then, You'd would I? you need to know the tyre size. Well, so it says, is this your vehicle? No, it's not. Hang I'll on, your it. vehicle has been identified as a Ford S-Max Titanium TDCI. Is yeah. this your vehicle? So it you is. get a little drop down yeah, yeah. like that. Yeah. So we go, yes, that's the vehicle. Yep. So far, so good. <laughs> <laughs> right. Then it says confirm your tyre size. Now it gives you an option. Okay. So it might be that we've seen that we've done tyres on the vehicle before. Yeah, we you have, have some yeah. history. Yeah, I've had three years. Okay, so it's suggesting it's a 22550W17. So let's say that's the size. Sounds right. Right, well, there we go. That is the end of this visit to the Motability Road Show. We're not out of it yet, we've got to get up this hill. And I uh, hope you've enjoyed it, it's been really good fun. Um, I gave them a bit of a grilling. <laughs> and that's over for another three years, because uh, hopefully, well, it hasn't helped me at all, has not helped me at all to decide uh, what car I want. I've got no idea, no idea still. I have absolutely zero idea. Um, so we'll have to wait and see. And uh, end of the year, this year, um, trade it in or keep it, I don't know, but it's a bit of a mess. I need to get it repaired first before I give it back. Uh, so thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, catch you again very soon for another, well, whatever you want to call it, another another show um bye for now